What's going on guys, it's Ranger Flame. Welcome everyone back to a brand new Demon Slayer reaction. We're on episode 2 now within this series and just thank you guys for your wonderful support on the first episode reaction of a brand new series here for the channel, man. Demon Slayer is something, man. You know, I just feel bad for Tojo. Like last episode, that was insane. A guy that you feel bad for at least because it's sad that their father passed away and especially being the oldest child out of five other siblings, man, that's a huge responsibility responsibility in general and especially taking the time to try to sell charcoal to this village and since you go to this village for so long you're trying to help other people as well because people know you and it's kind of like a second family when you look at it because you kind of bond with these other civilians and afterwards you come back home and to figure out that your family is all gone and that your sister is turning into a demon yeah that's um that's pretty crappy. It's just a 0 to 100 with your life right there that you thought it was great and then it just turns out to be crap. And uh, with Tojo's experience right here, uh, I'm excited to see uh, how him and Nizuku are going to do with this. Just because I feel like going with this, like uh, especially Tojo is going to become a demon hunter because they're not going to try to get this serum or whatever you want to call it to try to help Nizuku become to human instead of a demon here yet again. She's really different from other demons just because the other guy, I, I don't remember his name, but he was a demon hunter that said that if, especially if family members turn into demons, like they're completely gone. Like it doesn't matter if they look at you as a family member or anything else, they will devour and just like you're gone that's basically it but with her with Nizuku she protected Tojiro when she got released from him so that's a whole new aspect right there that Nizuku is not really gone she's just kind of half and half right now she still has that 50% of humanity within her that she knows that's Tojiro and wants to keep him safe no matter what and their journey moves on and this is how it is right here so it was a little bit fast pacing for me but I feel like they're just going to slow it down out here a little bit like I know the manga is so far ahead and it's confirmed for 24 episodes but I think this is going to be great for this series. But either way, guys, enough talking for me. And let's figure out Tojiro and Nizuku experience here into episode 2 of Demon Slayer or Kimetsu no Yaba. Here we go, man. Episode 2 at Demon Slayer. So their journey has begun. Hmm. <laughs> what a nice guy. <laughs> this is one anything to be free. Always wants to be the nice guy around. Uh oh. Wait, there's a oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. All right, and here's the opening, man. I actually did this opening. I did this opening was sick. The animation, the music, it's, it's fire. Here we go, man. Episode two. It's gonna be exciting. It's gonna be a nice journey. I don't know, and like, I don't want to compare this to a different anime because I always hate it. Like, it's a new series, they're doing their own thing, but like, them wearing the mask like that to kind of cover their identity, like, kind of what Tojo was wearing right there, man. It just, it reminds me of the Ombu Black Ops from Naruto. And they were still pretty sick. Oh, <laughs> look at Nizuku's face on the right. <laughs> a lot of new characters, man. I'm scared about that guy, I think he's a villain. Maybe the right kid there is too. And here we are. Nah, and she can't really use anything, especially with the uh, thing in her mouth. See, I'm really excited for that, man. If we see animation like that within the episodes, like, this is just beautiful. Like that blue white ball, oh, it's so sick! I really hope that's just not from Tojo. I think that's from gonna be a lot of characters. Like this boar man. Oh, yeah, I see. Okay, lightning, that's pretty cool. Like, that's so sick! Alright, here we go. Episode 2, Trainer... Oh, jeez. Sakonji... Uh, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce his last name. Oh, no, but she can't... Oh, no, I guess that's why I bought the basket, because it's dark, because she can't be in the light or else she'll die, right? 
Yeah. Hey, I can't really move at night because it's dangerous. <laughs> yeah, get in the basket. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, but since she's a demon, she grew. <laughs> Whoa, uh. <laughs> it's kind of messed up that she's kind of like, or he's kind of like, uh, it's like she's kind of like painting her like a dog. Ah, uh, he'll be okay. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> Too late. Oh, no, no, he's fine. He's, he's good. He's good. All right, I guess now she could... She can move around in the dark. Uh-oh. I feel like at this point within the storyline, you're going to smell blood no matter where you go if it's dark out. Uh, it's another demon. Okay. Oh, yep. This is my turf. Whoa. It's a man talking. Yeah, what? So... Some demons can talk then? Oh no, she's gonna go berserk. Uh, no, no, bro, we're demons. <laughs> oh, this is gonna turn out terror. Yeah. Oh! That was sick. Shay, okay, so is killing a demon in this? Okay, because he regenerated. So I guess sunlight and decapitation, maybe? Those are the two? That's all I could think of. Oh, no. Oh, he has super... Oh, okay. Yo, uh, Nizuku, um, yeah, we need some help. There we go. She knows. Uh... Uh... Okay, that just happened? Yeah, she just kicked him in the head and it's... Oh, he's... So... His body could still move then. Yeah, he's actually talking. I'm trying to figure that out then. Do you know what he reminds me of? He reminds me of he. I, I always hate pointing out things, but Hion from Naruto. Wait, what the? 
A head with arms, okay. Oh no. Oh, he just threw her like a football. Yeah, what's the deal, bro? I'm trying to still figure out the second weakness to them. Uh. Okay. Just like a simple. The head of his. It's like a rot. Wait, what the? So he could smell like a dog and he has a head of a rock. <laughs> <laughs> But now he doesn't have a weapon anymore. Uh oh. Come on, you get it. Yeah, there we go, Totoro. Oh, well, that wasn't very smart. <laughs> okay, we reached the halfway mark. That's pretty cool. Someone's gonna say, it might even be that sword, dude. Oh. There's no way it survives that. Okay, so it died? Gotta finish him. So it was another man talking one the night. Got rid of his family. Oh, hesitation's gonna. Uh. Oh. Nice mask. Squidward? So I'm guessing this guy's a demon hunter. Hmm. Stabbing's not good. Well, it makes sense if his head was gone off his body. Uh... Oh, this is about to get gory in a sec. Hmm. Still feel bad though, he's an innocent guy. Hmm. Well, I think this man doesn't even know about Nizuku yet. I think with Tojiro, he thinks of everyone kind of the same, even if you are a demon, you know? Okay, so he's not he's not gone yet. Is my body dead then? Hmm. Uh oh. Well, that's one way to get rid of him, right? See ya. Wait, but where's Nizuku? I was about to say. She's probably under the cabin. Or the house, or in the house. Haha. <laughs> I 
I was about to say, that man just dip? Like, what? Hmm. I wonder if this guy knew him, probably. Sakonji. Sakonji, right? Is that how you say his name? That is something to think about, yeah. Whoa. Just, he I guess, hesitations is weakness, son. Huh. She's not just any ordinary one, though. Oh, that's something that you regret. I remember the Demon Slayer court. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Nice! So his teacher's gonna be here. Whoa, whoa, okay, way too fast. Well, I guess he's also carrying his sister, but... <laughs> That's pretty cool. I kind of get like a Kilo of, uh, uh, vibe from Hunter x Hunter from that. Like kind of not hearing your uh, feet like a true assassin. See, what a good older brother, man. <laughs> yeah, that was a nice jog, right? <laughs> nah. You should probably just go through a lot more train. We're going to climb a mountain, man. That wasn't even the test. Feels bad. Huh. <laughs> I guess Tundra needs to get more of a leg day going. Oh, it just disappears. Yo, that, that's pretty cool. But I feel like this is not any ordinary mountain, no. I feel like if you follow the same path, it's just gonna lead you to a dead end. It's no ordinary fog. Ah. And since I guess he's so high up, his nose won't really work. And there's also traps. Um, this is going to get ugly. That's not just a trap. Uh, a pitfall. Whoa. Oh, it's not that. Oh, and there's another one. Oh, that would hurt. Oh. 
and he's gonna step on another one. This is a big challenge, just testing out his durability, his sense. I guess quiet, I don't know if quiet will make a difference, maybe. But it's hard about the sets, you can't really go slow and like look at the ground the whole time because it's going to be daylight before you know it. Hmm. I don't really know, can you sniff a trap if it's just wood? Or just trigger each one and just dodge them all? I guess. <laughs> I just love how he's triggering all of them, but just dodging them. That's what makes it cool. <laughs> oh. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> oh. Hmm. I, I think I'm calling this right now. He's gonna make it there, but it's gonna be day. But I feel like this guy with the red mask knows that he has potential. If that makes sense. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh, we're good. We're good. He made it. Got got hurt, but <laughs> made it. <laughs> hmm. And now he knows. Hmm. Yeah, this guy is sick. Gui? Gui? Oh wow, he just passed out right there. Alright. Hey! Got just before a day. Let's go. And episode's done, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Or maybe not. Oh, okay, no, it's done, man. And that was a pretty interesting episode. I like that. That was that was that was cool. Definitely a, a guy. Do you know what's weird about this? I'm calling it right now. I know this is at 13 episodes already, but for this series, I feel like since uh uh Tojiro and uh Nizuku's um I guess master. I don't know about Nizuku, but Tojiro at least like. I feel like um, his master has a death flag on him already. I don't know why. I'm calling it right now. I can just sense that, hey, I trained you to become a demon slayer. Like, kind of good families. Kind of like, I, I figured like they would relate so much and he'd be a father figure to these two. And then, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm just calling that. I know it could be far down in the future or maybe he won't die at all, but... I'm just, I'm calling that, personally, just from his character, but it was sick, man. The start of Tanjiro being um, a demon slayer, man. Uh, kind of an innocent guy that uh, just lived in a vill like a small village, or like, kind of outside a village. Had some siblings, and now is uh, taking care of himself and uh, fighting demons.
So here we go. I don't know if we'll get a preview for the next episode or not. Kind of nice. Well, we haven't seen the boar man or this blonde dude yet, but this they, they seem cool. Oh, Russ. I don't have no idea. The demon is in. Oh, is this kind of like a petite clover from Black Clover? Or Kodaki? <laughs> the Tosh OC. Uh oh. Goblin Mass. <laughs> Look at the music here right there. <laughs> Next episode 3. Okay, yeah. So ladies and gentlemen, that was my second reaction to Demon Slayer or Kimetsu no Yaba. I hope you guys really enjoyed this, man. I think it's a great series so far. I, I just like it how, especially with uh, uh, Tanjiro, um, you know, his experience that, you know, kind of just an innocent child, um, an older brother to a bunch of siblings and everything like that, is eventually going to become a warrior, if that makes sense, into perspective. So I I'm excited for his journey. And to uh, Nizuku as well, that especially, she's not any ordinary demon. Like, she of course like uh, comparing it to the demon we saw in this episode to what she is right there she's completely innocent you could really tell that she could hold her uh i guess emotions in place right there um but i feel like her kind of tick bomb that she'll actually put in action is if, if tendro is in a danger and you can tell right there of her actually kicking the demon and his head just went I kind of like an Attack on Titan standpoint with uh, Mikasa and Eren. If Eren's getting bullied or someone's like trying to fight with him, Mikasa will come in the way and help him out. That's kind of like, I guess, Nizuku in perspective to try to save uh, Tundra right there. So I'm excited for what both of them are going to do, especially me and their master right here. Um, I think Senkonji, if I'm saying his name correctly. I do apologize if I am saying his name wrong. I probably am. But yeah, there we go, guys. The second episode of Demon Slayer or Kimetsu no Yaba. I hope you guys are really enjoying this series. I think I am so far. It's great. And I cannot wait for more development from both of them but if you guys enjoyed make sure of course to leave a like comment down below what are you guys favorite thoughts of this episode who's your favorite character so far of demon slayer and subscribe to the channel that'd be greatly appreciated but either way guys we'll see you in episode three of this series very shortly but as always ladies and gentlemen have yourselves a wonderful day